In a major step forward for air defense, the German Federal Office of Bundeswehr Equipment, Information Technology and In-Service Support or BINBW, has signed a contract with Deal Defense for the development and production of the next-generation IRST Block II missile system. This agreement, finalized in December 2024, positions Germany as the lead nation in a multinational effort, with Sweden, Spain and Italy also playing key roles. The new IRST Block II brings several groundbreaking upgrades, including a new seeker, advanced electronics and enhanced data link capabilities. These improvements are set to significantly boost the missile's precision and operational range, ensuring it remains a leading choice in modern air combat and defense. The IRIS-T system, first introduced in 2005, has already proven its worth with over 5,000 units delivered to air forces around the world. Its versatility is showcased by its integration into numerous aircraft, including the Eurofighter Typhoon, Gripen, F-16, and many more. Now, with the IRIS-T Block II, Deal Defense is pushing the envelope with cutting-edge technology designed to tackle increasingly complex aerial threats. The origins of the IRIS-T date back to Germany's post-reunification era, when the country began examining the capabilities of Soviet-designed missiles on MiG-29A fighters. The Arch-73 missile, inherited from the East German Air Force, had superior maneuverability and range compared to NATO's standard missile at the time. This realization sparked a major shift in air combat strategy, prompting Germany to pursue the IRIS-T program. Since its inception, the IRIS-T missile has undergone continuous development, incorporating advanced infrared seekers that can differentiate between real targets and decoys, even under the most challenging conditions. The missile's thrust vector control, lock-on after-launch feature, and off-bore site targeting capabilities have made it one of the most agile and effective air-to-air -air weapons in existence. Today, the IRIS-T is in service with numerous countries, including Germany, Austria, Greece, Saudi Arabia, and Ukraine. Norway, after retiring its own stock, transferred its IRIS-T missiles to Ukraine, further emphasizing the missile's strategic importance. The missile is also being tested on South Korea's KF-21 fighter, with promising results. In addition to air-launched versions, the IRIS-T family has expanded to include ground-based systems, such as the IRIS-T SLM and SLS. These systems provide vital defense against aerial threats like cruise missiles and helicopters. Several countries, including Sweden and Egypt, have already adopted these ground-based systems, showcasing the IRIS-T's adaptability to a wide range of defense needs. One of the key advantages of the IRIS-T system is its cost-effectiveness. With a unit price of around €400,000, the IRIS-T is far more affordable compared to alternatives like the Pact 3 MSE, which costs around €3.7 million Euros per missile. This makes the IRIS-T an attractive option for countries looking to enhance their air defense capabilities without overspending. The IRIS-T is also a cornerstone of the European Sky Shield Initiative, a collaborative defense project aimed at strengthening Europe's collective air defense. Countries like Germany, Finland and Norway have integrated the IRIS-T into their defense plans, further highlighting its role in regional security. As the IRIS-T Block II prepares for its next phase of production and deployment, it is clear that this missile system will continue to play a critical role in modern air defense. With its advanced technology, global reach and cost-effectiveness, the IRIS-T is poised to remain a game-changer in the rapidly evolving landscape of air combat and defense for years to come.